bookcase or in the last lecture we add in our totals and then we created a sum function to give us a grand total at the bottom. Now we're just going to do some final formatting to our spreadsheet to kind of make it look a little sharper and more presentable. So the first thing I want to do is highlight the total row here at the bottom and we're just going to put a little bit of color in here in the background to make it stand out a little bit more like that. We're going to put some grid lines in here to kind of differentiate our columns and make our heading stand out a little bit more. And one note on grid lines you'll see all these great grid lines here. These are just guidelines. These aren't going to show up for instance if you were to print this. These are just here within the spreadsheet to make it easier to see where your cells are. So if you want to have grid lines in here that will stand out a lot. I will also show up in printing and you actually need to highlight the cells and go up here to your formatting section here. Click on the borders and go to all borders. And when I click off that you'll see it's put a full border around each of the cells that are highlighted. And you'll notice if I highlight everything and I click on the full borders. You'll notice that it puts a box around every single cell which is a little much to be honest. So I'm going to undo that and I'm just going to highlight each column and I'm going to put a border. Around the edge just outside borders. So it just makes each column of data stand out. So it's just a little cleaner and easier to read. And we'll just going to copy that onto these other columns as well. So you'll see that that just defines each column a little bit more and makes it a little bit easier to read. And then I'm going to go highlight these as well and go all borders and you can see that just puts a nice box around us. So that's just some simple and clean formatting to kind of spruce up your spreadsheet a little bit and make it look a little nicer.